He's held his new job for just about a month. As the Vatican's Secretary of State, he's basically the Pope's right-hand man. I'm just a start enough, so whenever you start something, it's not exactly easy, especially when your job is so demanding as being Secretary of State. His job may not be easy, but it is his area of expertise. But Orlin has worked in the Vatican State Department for 20 years, serving as a nuncio in politically charged countries like Nigeria, Mexico, and most recently Venezuela. Now the 58-year-old is back in his native Italy, though he does admit that an America will always have a special place in his heart. I'd like to send out a special greeting to all Latin Americans. I have very fond memories of all the years I spent in Venezuela. The Pope has been quite clear about what he wants to accomplish during his pontificate, from social issues like poverty and unemployment to more practical matters like the governance of the Church and its relationship around the world. And that's where Parolin's background will directly come into play. It's very easy to work with Pope Francis. As everyone knows, he is a very humble man who shows his closeness. Above it all, he tries to help us do our job and not complicate things. And so, together with Pope Francis, Parolin will try to re-energize the Church and improve its management around the globe. With the help of God and with the support of Pope Francis, I hope to be able to accomplish this goal.